Look at that headshot. Beautiful. All right, come here, Larry. Got a little shotgun action for you, dude. Whoa. Okay. See, we can take a few hits now <laughs> with our heavy armor on. Welcome back, everybody, to 7 Days and I. am an old guy gaming, and this is the Snow Biome Survival Series, where we play on a map that's made up almost entirely of the snow biome generated by the Nitrogen World Generator, and we play on insane nightmare settings. Okay, welcome back. Uh, I already said that, didn't I? <laughs> anyway, okay, so let's see. What are we doing? I have a couple things we're going to do at the trader here. A uh, couple things to sell, some forge work and some Kim bench work. Let's do the Kim bench first, since we have to uh, go down here. Uh, for that and uh, so basically what we're gonna do is we're gonna make some glue and I'm also I'm gonna keep this um, uh, coal down here because we need to go get some nitrate so we can make some gunpowder so let's put some wood in there and make up 24 glue um, doing that to uh, so we can make some more duct tape so that we can then make some more repair kits among other things so let's see, that's going to take 5 minutes and 13 seconds of burn time. That's good enough for that. And we'll come back down and get this later. Okay, let's head on back up. Alright, so let's see how we want to get this brass smelted and then we want to smelt this uh, little bit of lead that I have we got that from uh, digging our tunnel the other day and I might actually even keep working on on that now the thing is is I might move I might move into the into the city um, it's just I don't know it seems like it's such a long ways to come all the way back here to get to our base so I'm thinking about that I haven't decided for sure yet if we do stay in our hidey hole I'm, I'm gonna you know, we're going to make it larger and a little more uh, fancy schmancy than it currently is. Um, so really haven't decided that yet, but I'm, I'm just kind of considering it. And, you know, once we get some kind of a vehicle, it's not going to be as big of a deal. It's just such a long ways to walk. And now, you know, that I'm wearing the heavy armor, um, I run out of run out of steam a lot, a lot more quickly, too. So that's a thing. Let's go sell a couple things to Trader Hugh. I don't think he resets until, uh, what is it? Day 10, yeah. So it's day 8 today. We are almost to the next level too, which is fantastic. I'm probably going to put that next level in mother load because I want to do a little bit of mining and um, mother load will, of course, help with that. All right, so that gets us 699 coin. We've already looked at his inventory. I don't think he has anything that we want um, right now. All right, so we'll stick that iron in there. It looks like we have all of the brass smelted that we needed to. So let's make bullet casings, 105 bullet casings. That's a start. <laughs> That's a start. Um, yeah. Because we're really low on 762, so I actually I want to make a few more of those. On my toolbar, you'll notice that I actually put a second AK. Um, and that's because, <clears throat> you know, if we get into an oh shit moment, um, you know, I can just quickly switch from this one to this one, when, you know, when we run out of bullets and we don't have to try and reload. So that gives us basically two fully loaded AKs to take Larry out. Uh, plus the fact that we have our shotgun now, too. And, um, oh, actually, I was going to put points into Boomstick, wasn't I? Huh. Well, you know, since I'm going to do some mining, and, and of course I'm going to do that off camera, I probably will put the next point into Mother Load, and then after that, we'll put the next point into Boomstick. That's most likely what's going to happen with that. All right, guys, so we have um, this next quest to do. It's a Tier 1 fetch at a gas station. So let's go ahead and do that now. And then after that, uh, I'm probably going to go ahead and uh, do some mining so that we can make some ammunition. And this might be the end of our Tier 1 career. 
after we're finished with it, I can't, I don't remember if we have to do one more before we graduate to tier two. <clears throat> Excuse me. So we'll just kind of see how that goes, but I like, I like tiers two and tier three of the quest the most, just because we have the most variety of POIs that we can do. So let's go do that. Just look and see if there's any Larrys around. There's one out there. Two of them over there, but they're probably far enough to where, to where we don't have to worry about them now. Let's just kind of stay over here. Yeah, I, <laughs> my movement is in is pretty bad with this heavy armor on now, but it'll get better. It'll get better with time. We're pretty much at the point too, with our guns and our heavy armor that we can we can take on one Larry. Two Larrys, probably not so effectively, but one Larry, I'm not too worried about one Larry now. Uh, speaking of which, there are two Larrys right there. We could uh, still use our little tower thing, Madoodle. They're a little bit close. Okay. All right, let's see. Where's our... Uh, oh, there it is. I got it on the toolbar. All right, let's pull... <clears throat> see if we can pull one of them over here without getting both of them. Beautiful. Okay. See, I mean, we can, we can, we can kill a Larry with four shots of the shoddy right now, and that's with no skills and shotguns. So once we get a couple skills into shotguns, you know, then we'll be able to do even that much better. All right, let's try our our sledge. Yeah, see, the thing about the Iron Sledge is it's... I mean, it does two more damage for sure, but it's also it's it's also slower in addition to using almost twice the stamina, so I don't know. I mean, there's something to be said for the Stone Sledge for sure, but... Doing twice the amount of damage doesn't suck either. Okay. I want to, uh, I want to see if we can find some more ammo, too, so we need to be looking for places that we can cheese the fat loots. Somewhere around here, I thought I saw one of those, uh, grain mills. <clears throat> That's pretty easy to get the fat loots out, but I'm thinking that might have been further down south. Not really sure. I believe we already did that blue POI a couple of days ago. And uh, the quest is leading us to... Here's where I'm going to mine some lead and nitrate, too, by the way. Uh, but I'll do that later. Uh, the quest is leading us back in the same general direction that... What? Oh. Wait a minute. Hold the phone. Hold the phone. Hold the phone. <laughs> I was thinking fort and phone at the same time, so it came out as forn. Yeah, I don't know. Sometimes my brain. Is it this passing gas? Why did we get the little quest? You're near the quest marker sound effect. That was weird. I don't know. I don't get it, man. I don't get it. Okay, we actually did loot this place, or at least the, we got, we did the roof um, in a, a few episodes ago, so... No point in double looting it, except for that we should actually check the cars first, and we could check uh, the gas pumps too. Get a little bit of gasoline. We will be able to, of course, get this in mass quantities once we find the desert biome. Oh, 
Oh shit. What's happening? Running horde? No, 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 no! Oh! That Eve almost kicked me off. <laughs> um... Were those just random Larrys out walking, or what happened? I'm confused. At first I thought it was a running horde, that's why I was freaking out. Because I saw a couple of Larrys. All right, let's do this. Let's um, let's get all the way up on the roof here. We could have repopulated sleepers. See, we don't have enough ammunition for me to to spray and pray. So, even when we are using the AK, we're gonna have to try and get headshots as much as possible. Uh, all right, let's use the nine on him to at least soften him up a little bit. He's a little bit far away for the shotgun to be m super effective. Are there other sleepers in here? Can't tell. Yeah, that's not... I'm just wasting ammo. Trying to hit him from there. Alright, let's get back out over here. Got him. Okay. <laughs> um... There's a sleeper right there. Might as well kill him for the XP, right? That's a little bit far, I think, for me to jump down. That I could... Well, unless we jumped on top of the shelf there, we might be okay. But, nah, let's not. Let's not do that. We know, we know that the fat loot's up here anyway. All right, we'll hit these other cars. Uh, I want to start collecting cement, too, because I left my doggone shovel back at the base. Uh, because I want to do a little bit of repairing on the on the tower at the prison, because I'm thinking we're probably going to use that again for the next Horde Night. But I don't have a shovel to harvest that, so... Okay, well, let's start for realsies. This is a fetch quest. So we don't have to... We don't have to clear everything out, but we probably will. Perfect, perfect, perfect. That's going to make a big difference in our mining because um, now we don't have to use a hand tool and burn up all of our stamina. Wow, that was a nice find. <laughs> I'll take it. I will take it. That's We're definitely going to need to get some gasoline now. You know, I still haven't come across a wrench yet. All the sinks that we've checked for, uh, you know, uh, for cooking pots and all that, we haven't found a doggone wrench. What do you know? Yeah, that was a beautiful find.
All right, let's go back up to the front here, and I'm going to put down a drop chest uh, because we are massively overloaded. All right, we got a Larry out here. I don't want him wandering around while we're in there trying to quest because we'll probably aggro him. Look at that headshot. Beautiful. All right, come here, Larry. Got a little shotgun action for you, dude. Whoa. Okay. See, we can take a few hits now <laughs> with our heavy armor on. We can take a few hits now. All right, let's pop one of these just to make sure our cap is maxed out. And um, let's head on in. That woke up somebody. Edgar! What's up, buddy? Oh, shit. Ow! Edgar kind of banged us up, didn't he? Okay, we gotta be a little more careful. I'm, uh... I'm putting a little bit too much faith in my my shotgun skills because <laughs> we don't have any yet usually there's zombies that hide in those places okay well maybe not Let's hold off on that for the moment. Okay, so we're clear behind here. Does this go in the same room? Yeah, it looks like it does. Okay, let's keep that closed for a moment. I want to check uh, both of the bathrooms, and we have to check the little kitchen area over there. Come on, pipe wrench. No pipe wrench. I might, uh, actually, may I should probably hang on to the recipes we've already read to sell them. I guess it's kind of six of one, half does the other, though. Because you don't get that much either way. Oh, look at the sleeper down there. Okay, lots of sinks to check here. Yeah. Hopefully we get a pipe wrench.
Nice. Um, we're gonna eat this right now because we need it for both stamina cap and health. Why is there a light here? I mean, uh, where would I go? I think that's only one block high, isn't it? Huh, I'm not sure. Okay, that gives five health. Uh, no, that only gives two health. What the hell? That gives ten health, that gives ten health. And that gives five. So let's buy both of those and eat them right now just so we get the health back. I'm just going to scrap a doodle all those and all of these. Let's put that there. And we'll put that there. There we go. He's the only Zeker in there, really? Huh. I don't know if I trust that or not. Kind of looks that way, doesn't it? Makes more noise. Yep, I guess so. That's where we gotta go. repair kits. Take those. Uh, let's just scrap this. It's not worth selling. There's the satchel. Yeah, right there. Okay, quest is finished. Nice! We got ourselves a hammer. Uh, yeah, I can sell that for 160. That's, um, like, three cans of food, potentially. Worth selling, at least in the early game. Alright, let's see here. We're gonna head up this way. Let's get the AK ready. I don't remember if we had buzzards up here or not. How about if we see if we can pull one of these at a time? Well, so much for that idea, huh? <laughs> oh, at least one of them's an easy. Come on, Edgar. Oh, he climbed up on top of Easy's shoulder. <laughs> All right. Well, that's why we wear heavy armor, letter. Let's try that again. Well, that's why we wear heavy armor, ladies and gentlemen. 
<laughs> I don't even know what my mouth was uh, <laughs> was attempting to say there. I'm not responsible for what my mouth says sometimes. <laughs> All right. It's fun. Get a backpack this time instead of a purse. All right, man, I can't believe we didn't find a freaking pipe. A uh, pipe wrench, rather. With all those sinks that were in there. What the hell? Okay, we'll get rid of that. We'll get rid of that. Don't care about this stuff right now. And let's see what we got in the fat loots. Yeah, I, ooh, yeah, that's some money right there. And yeah, we're going to... This will... We will... Um, what you call it? We'll smelt it. Probably go ahead and sell that, and then I have another stick of dynamite back at the base, too, so that gives us a total of four if we want to blow something up sometime. Oh, man, we are so heavy. So, so, so heavy. Okay, well, that's, uh, that's pretty much about it, you guys. Uh, so what I'm going to do is head on back to the trader, and when I get there... I'll bring you back. Uh, wow. We have like two shotgun messiah factories here in town. Nice. Uh, I'll bring you back at that point and show you what we get for the reward and then we'll wrap up the episode. I suppose you want something in return. Okay, now. so we already have an iron fire axe. Yeah. I don't know if this one's better than that one. Um, but three vitamins would be nice to have because then we can eat the Sammy, uh, Sammy sandwich. Um, plus these are worth more anyway. Um, so let's just go ahead and take the vitamins. Plus we get, uh, 2750 XP and 333 Dukes. Uh, no, 330 Dukes. That's what I said. All right. We still have one more tier, uh, tier one to do. Okay. So I want to do the closest one, which will be this one here. Don't really want to do a buried supplies. Let's do it. Okay. All right. So we're done. Uh, actually, do I have a, I think I have a couple things I need to sell to him too. Uh, no, no. I wanted to sell him these. 350 coin. I stopped and picked up, uh, picked a few potatoes too because we can make the, uh, meat stew. We found the recipe for that in the last episode. Uh, so we'll use those to do that. And I wanted to sell him this. And I think that's it. Okay. Yep. I think that's it. Well, it's about time you bought something. It's about time you box something. All right, so we've got uh, more lead cooking up in here and um, more uh, iron. So I'm going to wait for this to finish, and then I'm going to make a bunch of bullets. We need to run down to the Kim bench and grab uh, the glue that we made. And actually, we could probably make a little bit more now that we have some murky water. So I'll take care of that, and we'll go back to the base, do a little bit of uh, inventory management. And then um, from there... I'm probably going to just do some off-camera mining uh, so I can get some resources built up, particularly now you know that we have this auger, which is fantastic. And then uh, we'll start the next episode from there, probably go finish that last Tier 1, and then see what happens after that. Guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, share the video, and we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.